Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. My name's Patrick. 240 crew, welcome back. Today I'd like to take a minute and introduce you to my other 1990 silver Volvo 240DO. This one is affectionately known as the Ron Car. Ah, it's known as the Ron Car because this car is the car that my Uncle Ron purchased in 1990, brand new. This is the one that if, for those of you that have read the About section on our channel homepage, uh, this is the one that's been in my life since I was eight. It's had a whole bunch of things done to it over the years, and plenty of projects that still aren't done. Uh, so today, I'm just going to do a little walk around, and then over the coming weeks and months, as we finish up some of the projects on it, We'll get to know the history of the Ron car and a little bit more about me probably along with that. Ah, so let's take a look. Okay, 1990 car with a 92, 93 dash with no speaker grill in the top. Uh, I painted it gray to match the seats about a million years ago. Uh, <laughs> it's holding up really good though, I gotta say. We have a gauge cluster with our uh, fuel economy gauge, our oil pressure gauge, and our volts, along with the smaller 52 millimeter clock and oil temperature, along with the large tachometer. Moving up. It's got the turbo grab handles along with the black turbo trim and pre-1986, at least here in the States, uh, gold sunroof crank that's uh, really nice chrome. Sunroof still works good. Doesn't leak or anything. These older uh, metal chrome gold uh, handles work a lot better than the later plastic ones. Moving on to our seats, uh, we have the older style leather headrest pads uh, on the older style headrests with some, uh, I believe, 1991 gray vinyl seats uh, that are awesome. I am still looking for a rear seat. If anybody watching this happens to have one, shout out. Uh, gray vinyl for a sedan, it's kind of hard to find. An aftermarket radio that is not installed, and at some point a while ago I was putting in uh, electric mirrors and only got just so far, as you can see, that is not quite finished. In the rear non-seat area, <laughs> where we would eventually like a seat, uh, nothing big to report back here. I have to redo the seat belts and the rear window shelf. Uh, I do have, interestingly enough, a rear window sunshade that I'm very excited to put in here. It's got the cup holders from the last model uh, armrest. And, of course, Volvo floor trays. In Wisconsin, you need those. This is where I tried to put on a carbon fiber vinyl wrap about, I don't know, it's got to be like 15 years old now. It's held up just fine, I guess. <laughs> I did peel the part off. A little loose trim. We've got e-codes uh, that we have to finish back there. We have some work to do in the engine bay. Uh, there's been a bunch of things done over the years. Electric fan conversion. I am running a B cam with no adjustable timing gear, which is weird. It's got the insulation.
Okay, as always, thank you very much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next episode.